Okay, so there you are. My bathroom is finished. At last, it's all the rooms on the ground level finished now. Um, so I can also move back into the bathroom. It wasn't so much work I had to do in the bathroom area. Um, so yeah, that was actually a quick job to do. And then as I move the stuff back, I will well, show and tell um, what I used and how I did it. So, so let's carry on with that then. Okay, the first thing I'm going to put in is my little basin. I'm actually quite chuffed with this. It's all made of um, balsa wood. I use balsa wood to make this. The drawer can open. There you go. And there's, well, some face cloth and, and even toilet paper inside. Yeah. It's just real toilet paper. I just used a little uh, piece of cotton and I... Um, round up around the um, kebab stick and then um, I might toilet paper out of that so yeah I'm not going to put a handle on this because the, it is supposed to open open like this I didn't want to put a handle yeah and then I'm um, like the little basin it's made of a, a, a real shell um, uh, I think this we call it the baby clam shell and um, this is actually the tap that came with the uh, original kitchen tap that came with the set here um, I put that here because it fit nicely and this is just um, little beads um, like this that I just sprayed with silver and then I put a little um, sequined bead there for red and blue for white and oh warm and cold water so yeah and there is my and i just put a backdrop here uh, of the same i can't remember why but yeah i did it so i just want to quickly color this And these are that I use for the towel and towel to hang here. I just use a little um, like a key ring, key ring, and then I add this uh, um, cute little bead with a little ring in it. So I just put it through here, and um, th that was a broken shell with a hole in. So I just put a shell around it, and there you go. There is my little. Um, I use that for the, the hand towel. And this, yes, is also a shell that I um, just placed against the wall. And I think yeah, I put wire underneath just to, and then I push the wire through the wall and I paste it there with glue. And then I just put some glue on the inside to make it just flat for my soap. Where is my soap there? My um, dental soap that i made um this is just a little it's like a capsule you use um but it's plastic capsule that my, my husband buys seeds in that and then i just put some glue or glue on the um, flat glossy surface just to seal it and this is just little um beads this little beads i don't know what you call it but um i use that and then that is just glue I making like a tear teardrop. I will if I will sh show a tutorial in the future I will show you how I did that. So there is my little little hand soap. And um then oh I've got this little um this is actually the lid of um my contact lenses that which I don't wear anymore. Um but it's a green fitted in by this 
bathroom so I just use this as a tray for in the bathroom and then this little bottles okay I cut it out of magazines but the bottles is actually um like the little um titty bottles I bought it for the um baby room as well but you buy it in packets I think it's for like for baby showers or something like that so the local Chinese shop so I just use that as a little container for um cream or face wash or whatever and then this is just a little um it's beads that i just glued together to make also a bottle this i glued in a bottle because this is not flat so yeah it keeps on falling down and that is holding this one up so yeah I put that here in the corner here we go and um yeah, that is all for here, for this corner here. Oh, I've made this little um, plant. It's also a shell that I, um, a real shell that I just put some glue to make it flat so it can stand flat. And then I put some plastic plants inside the shell for, to put it here. Check with the night side on the outside there you go and um that's all for for yeah okay so i'm quite happy with how the shower came out now um with this glass here on top it's actually quite cool and um, it looks much better with the inches that's hiding inside you don't even see it now and um yeah so the um uh, have a problem here yeah, but at least it can open um the shower head that i showed you in the video is actually from an um a squirting bottle that i had for hand soap it broke so i used that top for the, the squirting i just broke it apart and i used that so i don't have a sample to show you that but yeah i think it's quite nice now and then um also the little dish here in the shower is also a shell and then I've got this little plastic thing in Kimujiniki that we also got with that um, uh, thing that I'll check this hat it looks like a soap and I, it kind of fits by this bathroom so I'm just gonna put my soap in there and um, I also use the same concept of this shower handles for this like the same as here then I made a little um, scrunchy as well. I just used, um, it's the same as this is for um, your vegetable vegetable bags. This one was just green. So I just make a little scrunchy for the shower out of that. I'm just going to hang it here. I just want to put um, toothpicks in the wall through in the wall here. Yeah. Um, for hammers to put the stuff in and then um, I also got stuff for the shower here here's the other one this is also that same capsules and I cut that out of a magazine and I just put a little bit um, on top so there's my conditioner and my um, shampoo and this is ugh, like same a shower gel. I'm gonna put it in the window shelf here. Um, this one is always falling down um, because that's ideal for the stuff in the shower. Again, this the shower curtain is just a piece of blind, and I put some green sequin string there underneath, and I just place it with a little. Um, coffee stir stick against the window so yeah that is everything in the shower oh yeah i forgot to show something here by the basin as well um this is like a i've got this for a long time it's like a picture frame um with the other speeds around and glass so i and it was a 
two square ones and a round one so i used a round one and i just put a little mirror and you get in a like this compact powder little mirror i put that inside of the mirror here yeah and then the lights here i used it's also like compact um face powder or something um this little piece of glass here as you can see is just a half circle if i can just open it oh yeah pretty so there you can see it's just a little half circle so um i used that for the lights and i just sprayed it with um frosting spray and then at the back that silver is also the same beads as this that i used to make that so yeah so i'm just going to put the light through the roof in there i don't know how i'm going to hide the wire here but yeah i will see that when i come to that problem um so yeah that is the shower and then yeah by the toilet okay so this is also just shells that i um painted uh, um with a acrylic paint um just to match in the bathroom and i like to i saw it actually at one of our st stores that it was obviously not real shells but it was like in colors and i said oh that's an idea to use in the bathroom so that's a little shell there my toilet this the toilet itself is just a little um tablet con container like this that some i use for the um basin in the kitchen so it's a little tablet to hold it and then i've got this it's like a um, hair dye you use for your you just put a strands through your, your hair through that and um i use that but this can easily okay let's see that open oh but they are this come can out easily and then there's the broom for your toilet and then i just painted that um white so yeah and then your toilet can close and open i can just put this back here so i just took this little sponge out here as well it's on the side so yeah it fitted perfectly on on the toilet yeah and then the toilet can open and close and um yeah there you go you see there is my toilet I can open and, and close I saw my left inside green. This year was just oh, like at your um, hotel and guest houses, this little sample shampoos and creams you get. It was a nice shape. And I saw immediately when I saw this, I saw Barbie toilet. So yeah, so this top part here, yeah, everything just fits in nicely to make. And it fits with the size of this to make a little toilet. So yeah, there is my um, toilet then and um then i made this um well this container is actually from um like your thread that empty spool i used one that had green on it just to fit in by the the green of the bathroom just cut it in half and put some glue underneath and then this is just a um pipe cleaner i used i just put a lollipop stick through there a little wood around i made a whole new wood just so i can get inside and there's my little toilet oh wrong one there's my little toilet brush so yeah for the toilet yeah they're gonna be in the way there by the shower if someone to have a shower so that would be that side okay and then yeah i don't know if you're able to see but it's the toilet paper that's just on a um paper clip i bent so you can then put the toilet paper in yeah i believe in toilet paper over not under so yeah that's how a toilet paper is and then for this little shell here this is just also balsa wood and um, all the colors here, yeah, I just mixed a little acrylic paint with Mod Podge and um, just painted with, with that because I like, wanted a, a light brown in the bathroom here. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, oh, there's a little, it's just a, it was a white bead that I found and I just put some glue and then plastic leaves inside there. 
and I just put this little round top of the toilet yeah and then this is just oh lots of beads and shells I have so yeah this is just um real shells little shells I had and I put that here in the cupboard and then this is just little bits I put um, buttons underneath there to make it stand and um, I just made some oh, ornaments for the bathroom here with that this is shell beach shell beach must be in a sequence and then um this um towel rail i also i just used the um kebab stick that i sprayed silver and i um, used the same beads with the little hole in i just put wire around through the hole and put it in the wall so it can be sturdy and then on the corners i just pasted with wood glue some little shells to fit in by the theme of the bathroom so um, and the towels um as from that um, magic dusting cloth or cloth you get and uh, i had this this color was the perfect color and then the white is just a baby nappy so there's my towel my railing I've got another towel that I forgot to fold. So I make the towels big enough so you can really use it for Barbie. But this I want to roll up. I've got a few here for um, the swimming pool that's going to be next door by the LARPA. So if they want to have a shower after they swim, they can just grab a towel here, or even if they need towels for swim. I can just grab a towel, yeah. So yeah, there's all my towels. So that's everything for the bar. Oh yeah, and then in the dustbin, you won't believe the dustbin actually I made from one of my husband's empty asthma pumps. I used, as you can see, the shape there. I used that. This one was just white, and I just put a little um, foam board on the inside. I first left it white and with the wooden lid, but then I thought, no, I didn't like the white, and I just put twine around it, and then little wooden, also balls of wood that I just cut to size and filed down, and there's my little dustbin for my bathroom. And yeah, then. Oh yeah, and then this is a little carpet, also just used twine and felt. I just put um, some uh, um, wood glue on, on this and just paste it in a circle and around and then just painted it with, actually I thought, I think I, I used glue gun. Yeah, I paste it on this little felt with glue gun in a circle and then I just paint it over with um, um, uh, wood glue. And there's my little carpet for my bathroom. So yeah, I think that is now everything in the bathroom. So, and then this, yeah, okay, this little art piece, um, it's just like, um, well, you, we call it blockish flora. It's like wooden block flo floors in your house. We were on a bike thing something and I picked up this little few of these blocks on the ground and I said I could maybe use this in my barbie house so yeah and this is just a leaf I um, from the garden I sprayed it with gold paste it on the air with a um, mud potch and then just sprayed varnish over it and there's a little art and on the back side I just put a little paper clip to hang it here against the wall um, for art and then yeah Chloe so chewed up my little table I had here was standing here she 
stir it and chew it up but luckily i got another one this one i saw my just used that um this cookies i have got i actually like this one because it was like a half circle i could put against the wall but now i can't fix this one it's totally chewed and then i somehow used this cookie for this one here and, and then i used the gold cookie for the legs just to um um put this part of the um, living room and the, the spa area together and um but actually it looks like more like green than gold for me but it's okay because this is also green here yeah. so um it's also from that one to twelve scale furniture that my little my niece gave me for so the table is a little smaller than the previous one but yeah this is also the same i used for the um just a bigger one for um threading and this is just a little um string of beads like that that i paste around and sprayed it gold and then put plastic plants in there so I hope this is going to work oh yeah it's okay and then this light here it's um just this sample um blinds that i've got in that sample books so i use this blind for the uh, just with a cotton circle around it and then i use this little lights that i bought at the chinese store. okay this one doesn't work but um yeah i just put that light inside there so it can work on its own oh it has work but the battery is flat but yeah oh there it is okay so yeah it works <gasps> I actually forgot something. I forgot to put um, this back here, so I'm going to do that quickly. So, yeah, everything is now in its place. And I think that's enough. So for this video, yeah. Um, but stay tuned for the next one. Bye.